September 21st, AIDS.gov spoke with Latino and Hispanic community leaders about National Latino AIDS Awareness Day on October 15th and the National HIV AIDS Strategy. Good morning, I'm James Albino with the White House Office of National AIDS Policy. I was on a hill today to talk about the National Latino AIDS Awareness Day and to address uh, the strategy with it, which the President launched back in July. Guillermo Chacón, President of Latino Commission on AIDS, and we're here holding our annual congressional briefing uh, two weeks, three weeks ago, uh, away from National Latino AIDS Awareness Day. I'm uh, Dr. Britt Riosellas. I'm a professor at Cal State University Long Beach and the director of the NCLR CSULB Center for Latino Community Health. And we're here to commemorate the unveiling of the National AIDS Strategy within the Latino community. Why do you think National Latino AIDS Awareness Day is so very important? The most important thing is that we need to really increase the awareness, the promotion of testing, um, the importance to connect people to care, and again, keeping in mind that we need to focus on rural and urban communities if we want to engage all Latinos in the United States. How do you think the national HIV AIDS strategy will impact Latino communities? I believe the, um, the groundbreaking and historical um, national HIV AIDS strategy will help us as a, a tremendous highway to really increase the engagement and promotion to reach more Latinos and to again continue increasing the, um, the awareness but also testing opportunities in our communities. Do you have any recommendations as to how the Latino Hispanic community could use the national HIV AIDS strategy as a resource or tool? One of the first things we ask uh, community members to do is to read the strategy. That's an important first step. But there's also um, precise steps within the strategy that they can implement and use as a template at the community level. So that we're encouraging folks to read it and implement it at the, at the local level. We have um, several groups of promotores de salud, we call them promotores de VIH or HIV related community health workers that are working out in their communities conducting outreach, uh, growing knowledge, um, increasing intention to test, decreasing stigma and just generally giving us, uh, giving the communities that are most underserved and most linguistically isolated the message that they need to have around HIV because for so long within many of much of the Latino community um, the perception is that it's something that only happens to gay males and it only happens to injection drug users so this will be the promotores de salud are really able to integrate at the community level the message of HIV prevention and let people know that testing is for everyone that HIV can affect everyone and they're really making a statistically significant difference in the lives of Latinos who are most underserved. Where can our viewers go for more information? They can go to aids.gov or they can go to whitehouse.gov and search for ONAP. Basically, they go to our website and that's a lot of information that both is Spanish and English. You can go to www.nclr.org. We have a white paper on Latino, Latinos and HIV. And you can also hit the center website at www.cslb.edu, putting in Latino Center, and that'll lead you right there.